Team Biggs Bulldogs. Today is Friday, August 18th, 2023. Today is going to be a great day, Biggs. Our mission is to educate, prepare, and inspire. Our vision is to empower students. Will you please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We will now have a moment of silence. The Bully Free Pledge. I promise, promise to, to be safe, safe and respectful to everyone and help our school remain bully free. You may now have a seat. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to Tyon and Mrs. Russell's class, 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 Kingston and Mrs. Garrison's class, Sarah and Mrs. Stone's class. class. Happy birthday! Lunch choices for today are <coughs> cheese pizza, meat lovers pizza, ham and cheddar chef salad, turkey and ranch sub. Today's interesting fact is cockroaches can live for a week without their heads. We will now have a hallway and headline report. I'm Tiana. And I'm Riley. And I'm Miss Branton. Miss Branton, can you tell us about the leadership roles? I can. So, third, fourth, and fifth graders, we have begun leadership roles. If you were chosen as a student leader for this um, first quarter, you would have received a letter kind of like this. If you received this letter, it requires you to get your parent's signature. Once you bring this back, I want you to go see your mentor. Their name is on your letter. This is who, who's going to train you, who's going to oversee you. Um, this is going to be your mentor to teach you how to do this leadership role. It is your responsibility to talk to your homeroom teacher. Let them know about the role you were assigned to, what time of day your role was assigned, and who your mentor is. So you need to go see your mentor. They will have your hall pass, your, your lanyard with your assignment, and they will instruct you on how to do your leadership role. Now, for students that were not selected, it's okay. We are gonna be doing student leadership roles all year long. So if you weren't selected for this first, um, first nine or 10 weeks, it's okay. We're gonna roll, be rolling out more leadership roles throughout the year. If you did not have an opportunity at the end of last year to sign up for a leadership role, there are applications in the office. If you will complete that application, you can turn it back into the office and I will take a look at it and look at plugging you into a leadership role later on this year. So don't get worried if you don't have a leadership role yet. You will this year, I promise. So just, um, so just fill out the application and I will let you know when your role starts. Now, for our student leaders, there's a couple of things you have to remember. Academics comes first. So you have to make sure you're reaching your AR goals, you're turning in your homework, and you're meeting your classroom expectations. If you don't do that, you may lose your leadership roles. So in order to be a leader, you've got to be proactive. You've got to put first things first, and that means meeting the academic goals in your classroom before you do your leadership role. Okay? Okay. Have a great day, Briggs. Bye!